Namaste. Today I am going to solve a recurrence relation to find its time complexity by using substitution method. In this method, we guess a bound and use mathematical induction to prove our guess. So let us consider a recurrence relation Tn equals to 2Tn by 2 plus n. Since there is a constant in front of t, that is 2, if it is 1, we consider that is a, not a constant. If it is greater than 1, then we consider it as a constant. If there is a constant, then we suppose the time complexity of the given recurrence relation as Tn is equals to O n log n. If there is a there is not a constant that is one, then we suppose only Cn Tn is equals to O log n. Though n is not supposed if there is no constant. So that is Tn is less than equals to C n log n. And we apply the mathematical induction. So applying mathematical induction induction. So first case is best case. Let us suppose n equals to one, then T1 becomes T1 becomes C n log 1 it is 0 and we know that t1 is equals to 1 is yes? so it contradicts which contradicts t1 is equals to 1 it is 0 so we suppose next variable for let us suppose n equals to 2 then t2 becomes c2 log 2 or it becomes t n is equals to 2 t n by 2 yes so t 2 it ends is 2 by 2 plus 2 is less than equals to c 2 log 2 or it is 2 t 1 plus 2 is less than equals to it is c into 2 or the value of t1 is 1 yes so 2 into 1 plus 2 is less than equals to 2c or 4 is less than equals to 2c which is true but c must be greater than equals to 2 yes so we suppose it as true that is t2 is la less than equal to c2 la 2 so this is the best case now we solve the next step to show our assumption is true so we have to show we have to show Tn is less than or equals to C n log n. Now use the inductive step. So in inductive step we assume it is true for n equals to n by 2 and we prove it for n equals to n. So, assume 
it is true for n equals to n by 2 the n by 2 is used because in the recurrent solution it is there is n by 2 if it is n by 4 then we assume it is true for n equals to n by 4 and prove it for n terms yes so it is true for n by 2 that is t n by 2 is less than equals to our supposition was c n log n yes and we convert the n into n by 2 so t n by 2 is less than equals to c n by 2 log n by 2 is also true and we have to show it is true for n equals to n that is tn is less than equals to 2 tn by 2 that is our given expression plus n less than 2 so t n by 2 is value is c n by 2 log n by 2 c n by 2 log n by 2 plus n so it becomes 2 c into n by 2 log n by 2 plus n and again 2 2 is cancelled so c n log n by 2 plus n and using the log log arithmetic addition and subtraction approach that is it becomes c n log n minus c n log 2 because log x by y log x by y is equals to log x minus log y yes so it becomes c n log n minus c okay okay c log 2 is a constant term so we suppose that c dash plus c dash n plus n and the maximum power of this expression of n is n log n yes so n power 1 n power 1 and n log n it's it is greater so we suppose c n log n and d this is obligated as the power of n is less than this term that is for all n greater than 1 so from this we conclude that it is similar to our supposition so therefore our supposition is true that is tn is less than equals to c n log n and that is given as o n log n is true so in this way we find the time complexity of the recurrence relation by using substitution method in next video i am going to solve the recurrence relation to find its time complexity by using master method thank you